Good morning, good morning. Welcome to our 21 days of prayer. <clears throat> we are praying and seeking the Lord in these 21 days. Um, and on, on Saturday mornings, Wednesday, at lunchtime, we'll be jumping on together to pray uh, over the course of the next three weeks, two weeks left now. Um, but we pray that you've been jumping in with us, getting into the prayer points, connecting to uh, the, the items we've been praying through. And so we're very, very, very excited to connect with Jesus during this time and this season. And so um, <clears throat> why don't you do me a favor and share this um, so some people can jump into this and we'll get started in a second. As we look through the prayer points that we're going to pray about today. So family, let's see, let's see, let's see. <clears throat> today is actually day seven of 21 days of prayer. So uh, we're looking at. First Corinthians chapter 10, verses 31. Um, we're looking at that passage today and we're praying um, about how the Lord desires us to have health in him. He desires us to have health. And so we look at First Corinthians chapter 10, verse 31. And so... Let's get some people on here so we can jump into this prayer time. I know it's early on a Saturday morning for y'all. Y'all ain't used to being up early <laughs> on a Saturday. But I love being up early to seek the Lord and to pray. And so we'll, we'll, we'll pray whether there's one person or two people on here. Um, but we're going to jump into this time of prayer as we seek the Lord. So, here we go. If you're here, just comment in the section, in the chat section, so I know you're here. Um, say hello, so we can jump into this a good time of prayer together with one another. <clears throat> I pray that you all can hear me well. I pray that everything is is uh is good on this end, on your end. I mean, so. All right, let's do it. We are in 21 days of prayer. This is day seven. And so by now, we you know that we've been praying through various points of prayer. We've been looking at various things um, as we've been praying and seeking God <clears throat> through these different topics. And so we're going to look. Oh, I jumped to the wrong one. Day seven is... Day seven is actually Psalm six. Psalm six, sorry, Psalm eight. Um, says, you have made him ruler over the works of your hand. You put everything under his feet, all the oxen and sheep, as well as the animals in the, in the wild, the birds of the sky and the fish of the sea that pass through the currents of the sea. As we look at that, we look at the authority of, of, of God over creation, but we also look at the authority that God has placed into the hands of men and women. And so um, we want to be able to walk in that authority. We want to be able to walk in what God has called us to and to be able to look into the things that God has um, given to us yesterday we uh, if you you're tracking along with us so yesterday you were praying about strength and the strength of God um, from Psalm 46 uh, day five you were praying about peace um, from Psalm 29 uh, verse 11 and then day four we prayed together uh, on Wednesday about our relationships and so today uh, we're praying 
about the authority that God has given to us. Um, and so, good morning, everybody. Um, and so, good morning, Janae. So let's pray together. Let's pray and ask God um, to strengthen us. Let's pray and ask God to use us for his glory over the next days and um, and weeks, um, particularly in, in this climate in our culture, particularly in this, uh, this pitiful pandemic. <laughs> we're, we're praying that God would would use his people mightily and uh, use us powerfully and that we would access the authority that God has given to us to have dominion over things. We, we don't have to have a, a passive position. Um, we can have a, um, a position of authority and walk in, in what God has called us to do. We can influence, we can impact, we can make change, we can do things and make things occur. Um, through the power of the spirit and uh, that Jesus would allow us to um, change things for his glory. So let's pray to that end family. Let's pray to that end. Um, let's pray that the Lord would, would help us to do that. And so uh, let's jump in. Gracious Lord, we thank you. Father, we pray this day, God, we pray God by your grace, by your spirit, God, that you would help us, Lord. Help us, Father, to First and foremost, God, to recognize you and recognize you for who you are, God. Lord, I pray by your spirit, God, that you would encourage our hearts this morning, God. I pray that you would strengthen our hearts today, God. I pray, God, that you would help us today, Father, as we are seeking to walk in your good plans for us, God, as we are seeking to walk in your grace towards us, Father. I pray by your spirit, Lord. God, that you would help us in all things, God, that you would teach us, Lord, to love you and love your ways, God, that you would teach us, Father, how to truly worship you, Father. We, here at Epiphany, God, we we, we desire to lead lifestyles of worship, um, and Father, we pray that our worship of you would not just be something that we um, long for or reminisce about, that we used to be able to get together and do on a Sunday morning. Uh, but God, that that would be the fullest expression of our lives and of our hearts, God, that we get to worship you for who you are. And so, Lord, I pray today, God, I pray by your spirit, God, that you would help us, God, help us, teach us, instruct us, inform us, God, help us to be uh, fully dialed into you in this season, God. May, may, may you remove all distractions from our lives, God. Would you remove all of the things that try to divert us from uh, seeking after your glory, God, that, that divert us from being able to pursue you and the things that you care about. And Father, there's so many things that, that get in our lives. There's so many things that distract us. There's so many things that uh, can frustrate us. There's so many things that can get in our way. But Father, I just pray by your spirit, God, that you, God, would help us, Lord, help us, Father, to be fully engaged in you, God. Help us to be fully connected to you, God. I pray by your spirit, God, that you would uh, allow us, your people, God, to to know you fully, God, to know you more deeply, to know you more intimately, Father. And I pray, God, that you would um, use us in our hearts, God, to be connected to you, God, in deep ways, God. Use us, Father. We pray, God, that that you would align us, God, that you would, uh, that, 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 that you would keep us, Father, connected with you, God. But we know that we've got to put in the work as well, God. That's why we seek to do these 21 days of prayer. That's why we seek to fast, God, during this season, God. That's why we're uh, we're turning away some things, Father, to, to pursue you more deeply. And so, Lord, I just pray, God, that you would help us today. Help us, God, to walk in your grace. Help us to walk in your love. Help us to walk in your uh, power help us to walk in your authority god help us god to have your strength god we need your strength today jesus we need it um, more than ever god we need the strength that only you can provide god to be able to navigate these these difficult times god we need your strength god 
God, we need your strength. We need your power, God. We need your might, God. We need your grace. God, we need you, Lord. We need you. We need you. We need you, Father. We need you, God. God, that's the cry of our heart today is, God, that we need you. We need you, Lord. We need you, Father. And I pray, God, that we would that we would truly lean into accessing you, God. And, and, and that's the beauty of it. That's the beauty of being in Christ. That's the beauty of, um, of having your sins washed by the blood of the lamb. That is the beauty of having your sins forgiven by Christ. That's, that's, that's the beauty is that we get to have access to the father, um, through Jesus and that we, uh, get to have access. That means we get to have access to what we need, and so, Lord, I just pray, God, I pray by your spirit, God, that we will walk in that. I pray, God, that we will be able to stay connected to that. God, there are some of us who are on right now, God, who uh, are facing some major difficulty, Father. And I pray, God, that we would know, God, that you've placed all things under our hands. You've given us authority, God. You've given us dominion, God. And so, Father, if we would just utilize, God, the, the tools that we have, prayer, fasting, uh, uh, Bible Bible study and Bible reading, God, I pray that we would be able to really connect with you, Father. And so, Lord, have your way in us, God. Have your way in our lives, God. Have your way in our hearts, God. Have your way in your people, Father. I pray, God, that you would be glorified, God. I pray, God, that you would be exalted and lifted up, Father. I pray, God, that 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 you, God, would would receive glory from us, God. God, help us to turn away from our our own desires. God, help us to turn away from our own preferences. Help us to turn away from the things that we want all the time, God, and help us to be focused on your will for our lives, God. Help us to be focused on your will, your desire for us, God. Help us to be connected to your heart, your mind, God. We pray, God, today, Lord, that you would would be with us, God, and that we would be encouraged, God, to know, God, that we would be in strengthened to know, Father, that, that we would um, God be in position, Lord, to, to walk, uh, in everything that you've called us to. And so Lord, I give you glory today, God, we lift you up, God, we, we magnify your name, God, you are worthy, God, you're worthy of all of our, our all praise, God, you're worthy of all glory, you're worthy of all honor, God, everything, God, that we have, God, we give to you. And so Lord, in these 21 days of prayer, God, we, we're seeking, God, to, to glorify you, God. We're seeking to lift you up, God. We're seeking, God, to God to, to, to bring your name, God, to be known to the whole earth, God. And you said that if, 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 if you would be lifted up from the earth, then you would draw all men unto yourself, God. So we lift up your name. You've been given a name that is above everything every name and at your name every knee will bow every tongue will confess that you are in fact lord and so father we we cry out today god we 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 pray this morning god we say thank you god we we exalt you today god we give you glory god honor god we 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 pray lord by your spirit god that you God would 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 know and be connected to us, God, in deep and powerful ways, God. God, in this season, God, this season is tough. This season is challenging, God. I know that right now everybody is making all of their uh, their goals and resolutions and trying to get things together and uh, trying to do things the right way and all that kind of stuff, God. But we just pray, God, and we acknowledge, God, and we know, God, that you god have greater plans for us than we can even imagine that you have greater plans for us than even we can see that you have greater plans for us than we can even uh de determine god and i pray god right now god that we that we would recognize that god and that we would know god that you are lord today <laughs> that you are Lord. It is because of you and your authority in our lives, God, that we have access to what you want us to have. God, it's because of your great name, God, and because of your purposes, God, in us, God, that we get to walk, God, in what you've called us to be. And so, Father, I pray by your spirit, God, help us to walk in authority. God, help us to recognize that you've placed everything under our hands. God, help us to know, God, that you give us strength, 
God, a strength like no other. In fact, you are our strength, God. We don't have to dig from some deep place within us, God, but you are, because you are our strength. All we have to do is access you through prayer. All we have to do is ask you to be with us. All we have to do is ask you, God, to, to be our strength. And so, Father, I pray that you would be our strength, God. I pray in these 21 days, God, over the next 14 days as we uh, continue praying, God, that that we would be steadfast in knowing, God, that you are for us and that you are for us. You are not against us, God, and that if you are for us, nothing can be against us. And so, Father, we, we rest on those promises, God. We rest on those promises today. We rest on those realities today, God, that it is you, God, your strength, your power, your might, God. And if if, if our God is for us, nothing can be against us. No pitiful pandemic, no, no political uh, pandering, no, 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 no insurrection. No, none of these things can come against your people, God. Coronavirus, nothing can come against us, God, if we would just rest in you and walk in what you've called us to be. And Father, I pray that, God, by your spirit, by your grace, God, that you would be with us. In Jesus' mighty name, I pray, God, with thanksgiving in my heart knowing you'll do everything that you said you would. In Christ's name, I pray. Amen, amen, amen. Fam, thanks so much. We love you guys. Uh, thank you guys for being on here today and watching with us, praying with us. Um, we're sending out the prayer points every day on social media and in, and in, in um, your email. So if you get an email, if you don't get emails from us, um, you can just go to our website and sign up on, for those things. Um, hey, uh, Janae, what's up, cousin? See you, man. Pauly, Trudy, what's up, y'all? Uh, thanks for being on here today and um, and praying with us. And so we are continuing in these 21 days of prayer. We're going to seek the Lord. We're going to ask God to do powerful things in our lives. We're going to ask God to turn some stuff around <laughs> in this season. We're going to ask God to do some things again uh, because we know we can. And so uh, we love you guys. Grace and peace to you. We will see you guys tomorrow for church at 1030. Be there or be square. Peace out, y'all. We love you.